Without wasting any time, let's start. Press Windows plus X key together to open options. Then click on search. Type TSKMGR in the search. Right click on task manager and select run as administrator. Now pay attention. For some users, task manager would open in quick mode. If it opens in quick mode like this, then you need to click on more details. Now click on file menu and select run task. Now click browse button and follow my screen. Choose this file in C drive. We will need to provide update options before we run it. Now click at the end and type these update options like this. Now again pay attention. We need to run this to update the libraries. So check on this box here and then click on OK. Now execute gp update command. Follow my screen. This does half of our work here. Now execute this CLS command and now type exit and hit enter to quit this window. Close this task manager tool. In the next step go to search bar and type services. Now click here to open it. Now search for Background Intelligent Transfer Services, right click on it and select Properties. Then select Startup Type as Automatic and click on Apply. Then click on Start and wait for some time. After that click on OK. And now search for Windows Update. Again right click on it, select Properties, select Startup Type as Automatic and click on Apply. Then click on Start and then OK. Now close this window. Now click on start and click on settings. Then select apps. In the search bar type store. Click here and select advanced options. Now click on reset. And then close this window. Go to search bar and type CMD. Right click on it and select run as administrator. Now type these commands carefully. After that type sfc slash scan file equal to c colon slash windows slash system32 slash ieframe dot dll. Then type this command carefully. After that hit enter. Now type assoc and hit enter. And finally type chkdsk and then hit enter. It will take some time to complete its process. After that type exit to close the command prompt. 